Y'all know it's time for the cool. It's time for the percolator. and everybody in between I'm back with somebody else's hair and guess what it is wine and wig stay clink 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 did my voice crack oh let me fix that oh if y'all see my lashes and they be floating like a filter um these are magnetic lashes girl they can end up on the floor anytime I don't know which to hi how are y'all doing today I'm doing good obviously cuz I got on a crop top in somebody else's hair and I look good. <laughs> I feel like I'm fresh out of my faha after a BBL. Like I feel like that. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get into this wig. I wanna say thank you to Beauty Forever for providing this wig to me and sponsoring this video. Listen, listen. My, my mouth is watering from the wine. Swallow. So this is the 13 by four lace frontal water wave wig. It is in the color brown biolage, biolage. This wig is 150% density and 24 inches long. 24 inches is like my sweet spot. That's as long as I wanna go. I would love a 30 inch wig, but it'd be covering my booty. And I'm not trying to do that. <laughs> This wig comes with three combs and adjustable straps. As for the cap, a lot of y'all ask me what the cap size is. So this is a adjustable 22 to 22.5 inch cap, but I have hanging cap in the back. I did a couple things to customize this wig, but this wig to me is low maintenance. I already knew it was gonna be low maintenance because of the curl pattern and also because they gave you a bust down, boom, a little bust down in the middle. You didn't even have to worry about your part girl. They got you. If y'all wanna see what I did to make this wig look more, I feel like it grew out of my scalp, just please keep on watching and then I'll give you my final thoughts at the end. I was gonna hold off on filming, for this dog to self soothe, but the dog has been barking, can't stop. Can't stop himself, he's lost his voice, he's still trying to wail and scream and holler through it and it's getting on my nerves. But let's go ahead and get started. <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and start with our bays. So we're gonna use our wig grip. Pretty easy and simple. I like to use a wig cap that's closer to my skin tone. I actually added a little bit of makeup to this one. I use the same old dirty, crusty old wig cap that I always use. So this gonna have to work, honey. The wig cap is on. And now we get to try on this wig, grub, grub. Okay, we gonna plop on the wig. The girl, that's a good part. A good middle part is hard to find, ain't it? Like, look at that. <gasps> oh. So I did wash and condition the hair and bleach the knots. So all we need to do now is do a little plucky on a, a little lay and that's it. Now the hairline is already slightly pre-plucked, but y'all know how I know how I like to pluck now. <laughs> all I need to do is just pluck a little bit behind the hairline. I'm not gonna do too much because the last video I, I plucked a little bit too much and I didn't like that. I'm gonna pluck with a light hand. So we're gonna take our tweezers, do I have them over here? And we're just about to go in and start plucking. So I pluck in sections like this front part and then I pluck right here. I just pluck in sections like this. Boom. So I'm just gonna keep plucking until I get to my a desired density. So y'all just pluck with me, y'all know it's plucking party time. Pluck with me and then I'll show y'all like the finished result.
girl okay so i didn't over pluck this time doesn't this look good <gasps> Girl, this about to look good. The lace actually looks good, but I think she needs just a little bit more of like a, a little hint of tint. I have these lace tints from Flawless Illusions by Kellen Derrick. If you don't know who Kellen Derrick is, Kellen Derrick is a, a wig stylist. He is the, the brand behind Megan Thee Stallion's wigs. I have two lace tints. I have the medium brown and I have the dark brown. I feel like medium brown is my color. So let's go ahead and do it. I'm so excited. I'm just gonna spray inside of the cap. Oh, it's spilling. Oh no. Oh, there it goes. Oh, it looks good. It looks, it looks really good. Y'all can't see it, but I love the tone. Okay, now I'm gonna take my blow dryer he said to blow dry it on high and warm. Not cool, warm. Girl, this tint is good. I'm excited about it. I think it, yes. Oh, yes. Anyway, let's go ahead and get into flattening this wig i love how it doesn't have residue over top too Ooh, ooh girl we are in we're in the money okay so now we need to flatten the wig i use the zla flattening souffle i'm not a wax stick girl i'm a flattening souffle girl and with this type of wig use a flattening souffle girl it's gonna give you everything you need i'm gonna take some in my hand we're gonna pull it back. I'm gonna keep it as a middle part. Y'all know I've been obsessed with side parts, but I'm gonna keep it as a middle part. And we're just gonna flatten it out. So I'm gonna take a baby hair brush and I'm just gonna brush the hair backwards like this. And then I'm gonna do the same thing on this side. Just gonna brush it backwards. And I'm just gonna do like a light flatten over here. But I still want, like I don't want it to be so flat that we don't have any curls. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so the hairline is flattened. Okay, so I'm gonna pull the hair back just so we have it out of the way. Get a little ponytail holder. This is when I start feeling like a baddie. When I can pull this back in a ponytail, bruh. We're gonna take our rapid strips and I'm gonna fold it in half. And I'm just flattening like the very tips, like the edges, edges. Like not even the full hairline. I'm gonna tie her tight and I'm just gonna blow dry the hairline until she's like. I'm gonna use the Revlon blow dryer and we're gonna blow dry on high and cool. So. So I feel like the hairline is dry, so we can go ahead and pop this off and see what, ooh, y'all see what I'm talking about? Do y'all see what I'm talking about? One thing I know, ooh, the lace tint done bled everywhere. Ooh, this is giving BBL bandages, ew. I added a little extra tint because obviously um, this has gotten into my wig cap. Should I spray my wig cap? Oh, oh, I don't know if I like that. I'm gonna spray it into this little box, swirl it around, and then just brush it onto the wig cap so my wig cap doesn't like give away all my bees knees. That's good. That's real good. This is about to look good. Why am I yelling? Am I yelling at y'all? Have I been yelling at y'all the whole time? When I cut my lace, I always use my little Annie shears. I pull my lace down and I start in the center. And I get real close to my mirror. My hot breath be all up on my mirror. <sighs> because you gotta make sure you don't mess up your hairline, honey. I got to be careful. Ooh.
Let's adjust the wig, make sure we place it where we want it to be placed. To lay down my wig, I'm going to use the Wig Dealer spray. Now, I just spray it right over the top and then it melts down. Spray, blow dry, spray, blow dry. Okay. I only had this rapid strip on for like three seconds, but girl, we got other things to do. Oh, so this hairline is down and it's melted, and y'all, there is no real reflection. She look ashy on this side, but that's girl, it is what it is. But as for like the reflection on the lace, it is gone. So now we need to do our baby hairs. Y'all already know I'm the queen of baby hairs. You know what I'm saying? I'm not <laughs> the queen of baby hairs, girl. I don't even know why I just gave myself that title. Y'all look how good this looks. It's over for you. <laughs> so for baby hairs, we do the same thing that we always do, okay? Just a little flick, 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 flick. Like that. We're gonna grab a rat tail comb, okay? And I'm only gonna pull out like a couple of them. A couple of baby hairs like I don't want too much goings on so I'm just gonna comb out some of the product there is some um, some wig dealer spray on the baby hair so I have to be careful we're gonna take our little baby hair brush and we're gonna lay them boom and then I grab my little bitty scissors I like to cut them short but cut them at an angle so I'm gonna cut them like that I like to take the hairs behind it and just add a little extra swoop you know what I'm saying we're gonna do the side baby hairs
Okay, so our baby hairs are down. I ran out of rabbit strips. So we gonna just gonna have to let them mold the way they gonna mold. All we have to do next is get this hair together. We're gonna section the hair away. If you're looking for a good mousse for some curly hair, girl, this is it. It's the Shea Moisture Coconut and Hibiscus Frizz Free Mousse. And you can pick this up from the Amazon. So I'm just gonna add this product to the hair all the way to the, ooh, look how long that is. All the way to the end. So we just gonna hurry up and speed through. Okay, y'all, so this is the finished look, y'all. I done come together like butt cheeks. And look at this lace. It looks so good. The hair is flourishing. She's flourishing. Do y'all want to see the back? So let me show y'all the back. Let me show y'all what the back look like. Look at that. Oh, ew. <laughs> Can y'all see all the hair? still has a little bit of wetness up here I'm not sure that's what she said I absolutely love this hair I want to say thank you to beauty forever hair for sponsoring this video and providing this wig to me and of course y'all know it's time for the coup it's time for the percolator it is time for the coupon code of course I have a coupon code for this wig it is beauty YTB it's beauty YTB for ten dollars off I'll leave that coupon code down in the description box as well as the link to this wig y'all tell me what you think about this wig down below thank y'all so much for watching and subscribing and just commenting the past month or two has been i've experienced a lot of growth and to know so many of you all like y'all already know who y'all are where we chat we talk we friends girl so it's nice to have that connection, so. <clears throat> I'm getting a little for plants. I'm getting a little choked up, but I love y'all so much. And thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you in my next video. Clank, clank, clank. <laughs>